Uh, Terrence, tell us a little bit about naming the preseason uh, offensive player year in the OBC. I think it's a big accomplishment. Um, from I guess uh, from playing since uh, my freshman year, I've been uh, starting uh, punt return, kick return since my freshman year. So it's been a great accomplishment to me. Give us your thoughts, uh, general thoughts on the upcoming season. Uh, it's going to be a pretty uh, exciting season. Uh, having said uh, that we're playing two teams that uh, had bowl games last year, so um, it's going to be pretty exciting playing against those guys this year. Uh, you're part of a, a pretty potent backfield along with Ryan White, uh, who led the OVC in rushing last year. Tell us about the Austin P running game. Well, um, running the ball is um, a main thing on offense, and uh, Having a great running back like uh, Ryan White is um, the very good guy to play behind. Um, when he gets tired, I come in and, and do the same thing that he's doing. So I'm pretty sure that uh, teams are very tired uh, chasing us down. So having two great guys run the ball, um, top two guys in the OVC and running is uh, great to have on anybody's team. You have a chance to become the first player in FCS history to have 1,000 or more kick return yards for four straight seasons. Uh, describe what you try to do every time you're in the backfield or on a kick or punt return and how special teams plays out to help your team. Well, special teams plays a good uh, part on the offense because uh, when you uh, receive the ball, you try to get great field position so you have less field to score. And uh, that's a pretty important part of our offense. Uh, but when I get the ball, just try to do the best that I can for the team, try to help us score and get down the field. So when I get the ball, I just give it my all. I don't try to make a big play. I just try to put my head down and, and get as many yards as I can. What do you see as uh, some of the biggest challenges for you and the team this year? Um, I think one of the biggest challenges is uh, having a lot of younger guys on the field, uh, saying that we lost uh, – over 25 seniors last year, but uh, I feel that uh, the, the younger guys will come in and step up and play their roles because uh, we, after having seniors on the field, we had a lot of young guys that also came in and played so they can be ready for a situation like this and have some experience to play.